So my kids have been begging me to make some kind of Halloween treat that they can share with their friends. So I found a Monster Munch recipe, but took it to a whole new level. The kids really wanted more monster parts in their treat, so we did that for them. For this, you will need microwave popcorn popped in a bowl. I chose a brand with less butter since we have a lot of candy in this. Orange and black candy melts. I found the colored candy melts at the craft store. If you can't find these, just get some white candy melts and add black and orange food coloring after it's melted. You will also need candy corn colored M&Ms, candy corn, edible monster eyes. I found two kinds, a smaller version and then a larger one with bloodshot eyes, edible monster candy, parchment paper, two plastic sandwich bags, and scissors. I found a fun Halloween plate and cut the parchment paper in a circle so it fit in the middle. Next, I spread out popcorn to lay flat in that circle. Now it's time for the candy melts. First, I melted the black colored candy melts in a microwave safe bowl. I melted it 30 seconds at a time, stirring in between until it was completely melted. Then I put the melted chocolate in a sandwich bag and cut off the tip. Make the lines back and forth till it's completely covering the popcorn. This is the fun part, right here. Sprinkle the candy all over the popcorn. I made sure, however, I laid the eyes out so they were faced up or else they might just not face the right direction. And now it's time to finish it off with your orange candy melts. Melt the orange candy melts in the microwave for 30 seconds at a time. Stir in between until it's completely melted. Put the chocolate in the sandwich bag, cut the tip and squeeze lines over the rest of your Monster Munch. You really wanna make sure you do this in a different direction than the black drizzle, so it looks kinda neat. Let it dry. Now you have a great snack for Halloween parties or even just watching a scary movie with the kids. If you'd like more information, go to 9news.com slash fix this.